Art is coming to Duluth Lincoln Park. Over the next month, snow sculptures will pop up along West Superior Street near the Craft District. KBJR 6's Kendall Drabo explains how the project started and how these pieces are being brought to life. And I'll probably get up on top first and cut off all the big chunks in the corners. Designer and artist Jason Quick sets up shop Thursday morning in Lincoln Park next to a block of snow. It's not his first sculpting project, but for artists like Quick, who's from the Twin Cities, the pandemic left a big impact on their industry. I've worked in design and build in exhibit and big interactive kind of destination type creations. Yeah, immersive spaces and exhibits are not happening so much right now. So that's been a, it's been a clear hit to that industry. Business owners in Lincoln Park saw a need and wanted to make winter during a pandemic a little brighter. So we decided to have like a little art show outside with snow sculptures um, in hopes of building towards having a bigger winter festival next year. The district's first snow sculpture show will feature five sculptures in total. Each box gets its own team of artists. It's a project made possible by the Lincoln Park community. Everybody's given us food vouchers and things for them to eat and beer, of course. In tough times, a little support can go a long way. I'm already feeling supported by local businesses, so that's, it feels good to roll in and be supported as an artist up here. This year, Quick is following the theme of seeking light in his art, something he'll showcase in this snow sculpture. You get to interpret it how you want. It's either a light seeking device, maybe it's going to be a megaphone for people voicing what they want to, seeing it as a, an invitation for positive energy. With just two days to sculpt, Quick carves away at the snow, bringing more light to the already bright Lincoln Park community. Very cool. Excited to see that finished. And if you're in Duluth, you can watch the project happen. You're just asked to be respectful of the artist's space. More artists will get to work in the coming weeks. If you want to watch the sculpture's progress from a distance, we've got a link on our website, kbjr6.com.